Day 1. Dear Journal. After Australia's nuke, seven Spartans traveled to Australia but never returned. Now it is my turn to find Sydney and help the people that survived the nuke. Find all the Spartans too. I can now see the shore of New South Wales, Australia. It once was a home to many creatures. Now it is a wasteland. My ship has landed by a crater. It looks like a perfect place for me to set up camp for the night. Day 2, Dear Journal. Today is May 10th, 3075, and I just realized that the Spartans must have used this crater for a camp too. The reason I know this is that there are leftovers of a Spartan camp. Before I fell asleep, I found a small trail. I followed the trail and it led to a mountain. And at the end of the trail, I found all seven Spartans napping. What are you doing? You need to find Sydney ASAP, I told them. Most of the Spartans shrugged. We located it. We're just waiting for you to show up. You, be you, de you better stay with us tonight. We don't want to lose you. Stretch and look at this guy. It is getting dark. And in ten minutes, I fell asleep. Day 3. Dear Journal, I woke up and noticed that there was a digital map at my feet. I picked up the map and it automatically turned on. I examined the map and found a tunnel that led to Sydney. When the Spartans woke, I showed them the map and the passageway. Luckily, the passage was near the camp. The first person in the tunnel was me, and it was pitch black. After three hours, I saw the light of the others side of the tunnel. When I emerged from the tunnel, I was able to see the destroyed city of Sydney. I immediately raced down the hill separating me from Sydney. I ran as fast as I could, but there was only a family that survived. One family that survived. I sent the chopper, I sent for a chopper, and one hour later the chopper was 20 feet from me. I helped the family on the chopper and the Spartans and I got a, back, a ride back to New Zealand.